children. All in the family. Stuff like that. Like, you know, enjoy that. Uh, books that you read, streaming personalities. I, I watch, I, well, I don't really watch streaming personalities either. Boy, we're going to run into some problems here. I'll just, I'll read off to you some of the shit I watch on YouTube, and then you can make the decision of whether you can stand it or not. Uh, I watch Crit Crab, who talks about uh, disastrous D&D experiences. OSW Review, who talk about wrestling events. And OSW's been around forever, man. Uh, Creepy Pasta Shit. Dr. Creepin. Mr. Creeps. Shit like that. The Exploring Series. Explore with us. Uh, let's see, what else? What else am I watching? Oh, you know, there's actually a newer channel that's out right now uh, that does video game videos in a way nobody else I've ever seen do them before. I'm sure this guy's going to end up being wildly fucking popular. When did his channel go up? Uh, September 2020. Uh, the channel's called You Can Beat Video Games. And I, I don't know how to explain it. If you watch a video, you'll see what I mean. It's like, imagine those old VHS tapes where they do like tips and tricks to beat a game. So imagine somebody's let's playing a video game and then they've got like a magazine style presentation overlaid on it or like a PSA video game uh, pro shit from the 80s. It's very hard to explain, but it's one of the more unique ways I've seen somebody do this kind of shit. Um, and it's it's pretty fantastic. I have a feeling like, you know, in a year or two, this guy will have a million plus subs. Kind of like I did with um, Chubby Emu. I remember when his... Uh, channel first started popping up and I was like, oh, that dude's going to be a million or two million or a million subs. And he was. Uh, let's see. Fact Feast is another one I watch because uh, I want to hear about how horrible life was at Edwardian and Victorian England. <laughs> so it's quite entertaining. Uh, Coffeehouse crimes, uh, dreading, shit like that. I'm trying to think. Uh, Don Shipley. I don't know if you guys uh, remember him as Buds131. Uh, he used to do, like, the uh, Stolen Valor videos, but YouTube took down his channel, so he had to go make his own private website for it. Uh, but he used to go out and, like, confront people that did Stolen Valor. Like, he'd, dri he'd drive out. He'd go across country sometimes. There were, well, at least a couple of times. Usually it'd be a phone call. But there were a few times where we went to confront people. Uh, and those were highly entertaining. A uh, Patrician TV, 91 Tech, uh, shit like that. Nick, or what is this, Nick930. It's just, it's video game shit and uh, long form videos and story shit. Documentary stuff. Uh, that chapter, already talked about that. Uh, Townsend's. I watch that. Love Townsend stuff. I'm trying to think, is there anything else in here? Uh, Tronics Fix. Uh, Hoax Hotel. Like that stuff. Uh, I don't know. Is that is that enough of a list? Uh, I think that's a decent uh, summoning salt. Good stuff. A uh, defunct land. Good stuff. Eight bit guy. I love his stuff. Ahoy does some really good long form videos. I'm just I'm just scrolling down LGR like his stuff. Uh, Game Sack watched a bunch of their stuff. Okay, I think I've given uh, cross counter TV. I used to watch, but like. Um, I don't know what happened with that. I, they had a falling out or something. Um, and so, like, all their really good Street Fighter stuff stopped. So I don't know where that's really going anymore. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go with the Orange Fool shit. You, the, you, people made that motherfucker cry. <laughs> they made him cry over that. He made a fucking drink, a historically accurate drink, and everybody thought it was like a political statement. And he got all fucked up over it. I've watched so many of his videos and he never talks about politics. <laughs> I really don't think Orange Fool was meant to be a slight against the president at the time. Because, I mean, this was a while ago. I think he literally just wanted to do... He does cooking videos. And, you know, uh, dessert videos. And so he probably threw it in there. <laughs> that he got so much shit. Oh, uh, let's see. I'm just looking at regular chat now. Shipley is a riot. Recently posted a fake DD214 uh, on his as an example, and a bunch of retards messaged him thinking he could forge them. I, I, I loved watching his stuff. It really sucked when YouTube took his stuff down. Uh, but again, he made his own website for a while, and I think he survived it just fine. 
Oh, uh, the Orange Fool drama. Poor old fucker. Yeah, it was. It was. It was. He was pretty fucking devastated over that. <laughs> he made like in a village. Oh, Wendy Goon is another guy I watch. Yep, that's. Uh, he does really fucking amazing videos. Uh, yeah, I watched Tasting History too. I've checked out his stuff as well. Uh, so there you go. Uh, to answer your question, because uh, I couldn't really give you a lot of uh, movies and TV shows, but I can give you a general idea of like uh, YouTube stuff. It's a smattering of everything. Uh, from Jake MX Zero, love you, Jim. You're the best. What's your thoughts on Noel's prediction that you'll stop watching anime and be magically cured and outlive Ethan Ralph? I just love anime too much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, boys. It's an early grave for me because I need to watch my anime. From Chip Tracy. Uh, Jim, I'll always miss you. You gave me so many laughs over the years. I'll always uh, miss your photon streams and the sped dating. You'll always be my internet shit poster hero. From uh, SZ, 